hello today in this video we are going to discuss about how to install or how to how to place a custom module in our add-ons path in our earlier video we have already shown how to add a custom add-ons path for your Odoo instance for that what you have to do is just what you have to do is that just you can create a new folder uh, let it be custom add-ons and you have to place this inside the odoo.conf file that is your configuration file so that is all about how to setting up a custom add-ons path now we will see how to install a custom module in it for that uh, we will go to Odo app store and we will download a simple module okay uh, I will load our own module we will choose a module from version 11 as we are demonstrating in the Odo v11 Okay, here from here we will get a module in V11. I'll download it from here. Okay, downloading. Yeah, it got downloaded. Now you can go to downloads. Yeah, you can see this. This is the module we have downloaded now. Once you download this module, it will be in the zip format. To place it in the add-ons path, we have to extract it. So I will extract here itself. So I downloaded the module and I extracted it here. Now I have to place this module inside the add-ons path we have added so I will just cut the module from here and we'll go to home folder inside Odoo Odoo 11 this is the custom add-ons path we have you created so I'll paste the module inside this so this is the more module we have downloaded and placed inside the custom add-ons path yeah it will get loaded here you can see the custom module get loaded so once you place the module inside the custom add-ons path you have to make sure that the custom add-ons path is specified in the corn file if you are sure with that you can just restart the service as i am using PyCharm, i can just run run restart the service from here so i just restart the service then we have to go to the front end now if you search for the app uh, the app name is checklist so I will type checklist so either you can make a search by this name this is the name of the module and this name is called as technical name so I'll just copy the technical name and search here either we can make search using technical name or using this name we can check here so right now when I check with the technical name the system says that there is no module found for the module to appear in the system what we have to do is that just activate the developer mode first okay from the settings you can activate the developer mode once the developer mode is activated you have to click on update app list here click on update app list and click on update so the system will get updated with the latest module that we have added in the add-ons path so again I will make the search with the technical name now I can see the module displayed here so this is the module we have downloaded from the store and right now we can see it in the in our apps list so this is all about how to add a custom module so for that what we have to do is that either we can develop a module our own or we can get module from github or from Odo apps once you download the module from the Odo apps it will be in the zip format so you have to extract it first and you have to place it in the add-ons folder after placing it in the add-ons folder you have to restart the service Odoo service once the Odoo service is restarted come to the front end and activate the developer mode after activating the developer mode you can click on update app list and click on update button and you can search your module here and next I will check, search the name I will search with the checklist you can see here then you can just click on install button Okay, I'll click on install button. So, for getting it, it installed, it will take a few time. Okay, you can see. Uh, yeah, the system is loading. It will get installed. Okay, if we go to here again and search for the module, you can see that the status that is module is installed. The status is installed. We now we have only seen upgrade and uninstall button so this is all about how to install a custom module in Odoo thank you if you have any queries please comment it out in the comment section we will reply you as soon as possible thank you